we remain in Fort Dawnguard. Having taken a good look around, there was not much for me to find. Some steel bolts at the very best. And healing potions. But I couldn't, for example, find any usable armor. So I'll have to make do with what I have. Let's give these vampires what they are begging for. By attacking the Vigil. Isran found something for you to do, eh? I'll yep, tell you, the only did. thing more surprising than hearing from Isran after all these years was hearing that he wanted my help. I immediately realized things must be pretty bad. Looks like I was right. You worked with Isran before? I have. There was a time years ago when we were both members of the Vigilance, and both equally dissatisfied with them. Their hearts are in the right place, of course, but Isran and I were never comfortable. We left together, but that partnership didn't last very long. I didn't agree with some of his methods. I see. But I do mm -hmm. like to Until know that you think the Vigil had their hearts in the right place. You then? Yeah. Hmm, why did you join the Dawn Guard? I lost two wives to vampires. I will avenge them. It's good to know that I will not have to do it alone. I'm glad this Dawn Guard exists. Vengeance. Well, surely a good motivator. I'm not sure if that's the one you want to have behind your actions. But well, I have to admit, vengeance is driving me for the dist the fact that the vigil hall of the vigilance has been destroyed. That's what has me putting everything else aside and going to check out what these vampires are doing. I will admit it. But then, in which part of Skyrim was it again? Let's see. Oh, all the way ne between Mordal and Dawnstar. Guess I'll be having to make a stop at either Windhelm or Whiterun. Unless a carriage can provide me a quick transport. Probably should go through White Run, it's warm out there. On the other hand, I've got camping supplies, I should be able to make the track through the road net yet not explored. Who knows, I might find something interesting along the way. But this Day Spring Canyon sure is a nice place. Should be defensible as well, given it's so long and has ups and downs. I just hate that I cannot bring my horse here, would make the travel so much faster. We there yet? Ah, oh, there's the opening. Indeed, if I hadn't mentioned... Oh dear. Somehow I got the feeling I should have guessed this would happen. In any case... What now? You foes! Probably was not the best time to attack right after another fight that I won quite handily. Note from an assassin. Armor and poison. Not interested. But here, Argonian. I recognize you as a living being. 
of intellect. Now then. As instructed, you have to eliminate Lord Ben saw the fort by any means necessary. The Black Sacrament has been performed. Somebody wants this poor fool dead. I probably know who that is. The Thalam are getting desperate, aren't they? Now, let's see. Wolf Belt and... So, let's see, how am I going to make this? Straight through here, then along Riften Wall, back up towards Shaw Stone and continue along the road. That's probably the way. Again, no need to bother myself with that little place there. Oh, who am I kidding? I'll need the warm up. Hopefully, nothing goes wrong. But after all, I'm a tactician, and bandits usually are not the sharpest tools in the shed in that department. What happened with that shot? And there you go. Two of you down. Book called King. Yeah, sure, I'll take it. Steel cave have a bad claw hood. That's a mouthful. It looks warm. And it's actually armored. A worthwhile exchange. A mantle for 65 and the hood for 45. But on the other hand, armor. Armor's always useful. 41 compared to 64. Indeed. Oh, and you are indeed an intelligent humanoid. Anyone else in this spot? I don't think so. There we go. Now it should be safer to travel to Fort Dawn Guard. No need to risk all this. A little bit to the right, perhaps? Yes, that was the spot. <laughs> Another padded per hood. I'll be leaving it here. And well... I guess since I took your hood, I could leave you with mine. But it's got some good value on it. I'll keep mine for now. No use uh, taking the other, though. Now then, back onto the road. There's some blue mountain flowers there, weren't it? Better pick those up. I just spent some. Now then, if we could stay on the move for once. Hmm, there's a building on the right. Wait, am I being attacked by wolves? Yes, yes again. Where do these even come from? And I'm guessing that's Rift then, isn't it? it got to be. Thus, the way is through here. As it was the last time, and I'm still not interested in going in exactly, given the, the greeting the guards gave me the last time. 
I could ask for a ride, but then again, would my horse come with? Hmm. Shouldn't hurt to ask. Need a ride? My carriage is the safest way to travel. Need something? Well, actually, I would have needed a ride, but since you don't seem to be offering me any, I'll just be on my way. I can handle it on my own. There was that one for along the way, but I am not uh, willing to take down an entire fort. Two ambushers, yes, why not? But an entire fort full of bandits, no. On the other hand, the path leads this way, so... Oh dear. Let's try and take care of this quick. Ugh, poison. Don't like, don't like at all. There's three of you. I didn't expect it such an amount. Now there's a bear. Not as planned, not as planned, not as planned, not as planned. Another spider down. Bash that one. If I get the spiders, I can handle the bear. Poisoned. I am moving slowly since my stamina's out. There we go. That was... That was a tough one. Hey! Pulled through in the end. There we go. Ain't going to bother with the poison this time. Please take care of the bear belt for me. Up. And back onto the road. First I see two spiders, then a third one appears from the left, and then a bear strikes from uh, uh, behind. It will be on the right side. So, I guess that was a test of awareness, if nothing else. Glad I pulled it off, though. Would have been a royal shame to go out fighting against vampires and then die to a bunch of stray wild animals. From farther away, those rocks look suspiciously blue. No, they were simply grey. But the nerds going on over there. Do I want to interfere? Looks like a bunch of bandits and an honest fellow, it does. This ain't going nowhere. What? That hit? That did hit. No way that didn't hit. Tell you what. You stop babbling. And we can call it a fight. Too bad I was too late to save the traveler. Now I'm going to feel guilty about it, am I not? But... The least I can do... Is another Fallen. Oh dear, oh dear, this man had lots of things. A good pickup for the bandits for sure. 
Am I robbing him? No, I'm just taking this. The other people tried to take, but in the end were unsuccessful in. But how is that different actually? Oh well. Whatever's the case, they would go to waste if I didn't do anything with them. Unless somebody found them out here, but what's the chances they are anything other than bandits? Where'd my horse go? <whistles> ah, there he is. Hiding behind a tree. No, is this way. But I've got to uh, concede that my aim with my bow was about as good as my swing with the sword. Missed two arrows and missed the blood and charge in. Perhaps my sword is shorter than I believe it to be. No rude jokes, thank you. Oh, blue mountain flowers. Now then, this takes me lower and from there go head right and more spiders let's try the sizzling touch out shall we well that didn't do much even with the static skin So I guess it's not as powerful as I had thought. Ah, there you are. Almost talked, you had run off again. But in the end, wasn't the case. So, am I making a stop at Winterhelm? Probably not. Well, I could always have a chat with... Who are you? May your bed be warm. And your food, sweet. Ah, uh, merchants. Well, good luck on your travels wherever you are now going. Don't think that's the right way down, though. Well, who are you then? Good afternoon. Hmm? Nobody, apparently. My travels on the road have sharpened my skills. Let's see here. I'll pick Magicka for a change. Hmm, what's here? The crushing thunder of your armor falls, be falls behind every blow, combining wake the movement to amplify your strikes. I become more powerful through my armor. Sounds good to me. Oh, what was that? I'm on the right path still, yeah? 
Nope, we're going in the opposite direction. I've got a bad sense of direction, do I? I hope there's a traveler out there, that's even worse. Although, that is that is not very nice for that traveler. Perhaps I should not hope such things. They would possibly get quite hopelessly lost. A uh, wolf. And a spider. Well, I was wondering why keys aren't working. Apparently I had not drawn my weapons even though they were clearly visible. How funny. Oh well. Got an extra dose of poison I could have done without, but in the end... No real harm done. There's my horse, and there's the leather. At least leather to be. And back onto the move. Scratch that, what's this? Brandum. Perhaps I'll find some use for this. Well, it'll take just a moment. And there we go. That wolves? Yep, that's wolves, all right. Stay here, horse. Let me see if I can get them back into my sights. Doesn't look like it much. I'm quite sure we'll collide in them in a moment, so... I'll keep my blade ready. Well, hello, Greetings, brother. You look weary. I have something to help you relax if you're interested. You're talking about skooma, aren't you? The finest skooma, the sweetest moon sugar, at a fair price, of course. I don't like the fact that this does really not seem legal. Ah, uh, snitch, eh? Can't have you running through any guards now, can I? You're as good as dead. Do not strike me again. For each blow you give out, I will strike back. Yield. Yield. Do not continue fighting. Yield. Fight. If you are so inclined. I gave you multiple chances to repent. Do not succumb to your lawless ways. Uh, even though I do not exactly feel like leaving all this material here, I'm not going to carry it myself. I should take him off the road, shouldn't I? Silver, not a jewelry crafter, am I? This is a heavy head. 
I guess I'm not moving him out of the way then. Some bandits going to have a field day. You shouldn't have. But you did. Not smart. But again, you are an animal. Ain't there much to be smart with. A warm neighborhood. How lovely. Seriously? And now I got rock joint. Didn't need it. Got it anyway. What does it do? Twenty of percent less effective with melee weapons. Yeah, that's not going to stay if I can help it. Okay, this is potions two off. Yeah, sure. So, why do you join the Stormcloaks? My cousin disappeared. Hmm. Stormcloaks having a chat. I'm pretty sure I heard a dragon. Hopefully, it's not coming for me. Although, here I would have a better chance than I would have had at the slopes of the throat of the world. Still, I'd rather avoid combat with dragons. And down. I don't understand these wolves. Are they starving? Got to be. But they are getting annoying. Majorly so. Couldn't they just... Cease? Well... There are no survival wolves to tell anyone that. Perhaps I was a werewolf, but that again, that would mean I would need to worship her scene, and that's not going to happen. Hmm, it's colder up here. And I'm thirsty. Would this be enough for food? Yes, that's enough for food. And let's put the new food on. And the warmer boots. Should I stop here for once? Hmm. I'll check in with Alfred once I'm returning from the vampire's tomb. As I said, I should be leaving everything else for now and just focus on getting the vampires. What's wrong with my aim? Alright, let's try this from the ground then. Perhaps the horse is throwing my aim off. That's more like it. There we go. Much better. If only I could cook wolf meat. That would make it all better. But no, I cannot cook it. 
whatever's the problem. Is it too stringy? Do I burn it? I can eat short skiva meat, alright? And do I hear more wolves? Hello, fellow traveler. This is the correct direction to head, yes. Yep. If I go far enough... I should go on the other side of the road, but yes, eventually I'll end up where I should end up. A lumber mill, I see. Angas mill, as they call it. Nothing much to see there. Do I hear wolves again? Am I getting paranoid about wolves now? Paranoid about some irritating animals popping up to my side to taste my blade once and be it over and done with? Well, that's a wolf for sure. An ice wolf, but a wolf. And handled like the rest of them. Took a little bit longer, but I could stop at the Blue Mountain Flowers. So, yes. It's chilly out here in the north. Slowly but surely, it's overpowering me. But in the end, I've got firewood with me, so there should be no worry about it. So... Winter hold that way for the college, I see. But I'm heading for... Taking a stop at Dawn Star would probably be applicable. Forsaken Cave. Wonder why. A wolf. Got him. The other one's right over there. Hmm, already thought it was going to escape, but no, coming right for me. Not a smart choice, pup. What? Back tactics. First time I've seen resemblance of intelligence from these. But again, feral intellect. Not exactly the kind you'd need to defeat a human with tactics. I'm not approaching a forsaken cave. Hmm, wonder where that path leads. Don't think it's anything I will I will need to find out though, so very cold. Am I now? Oh, but as luck would have it, there's an inn. How late is it? Oh, it is merely five. Helljarschen Nightgate Inn shall provide me some much needed heat before I go on on my journey. Won't even need to pay for a room, but I can fill my water skins.
Yep, that they can very much do. Knock knock. Come on in. Just stoke the fire. Take a seat and get the cold out. Yeah, that's what I was planning to do. <sighs> Better take the moment to warm up. That's that. Then let's do some business in here. Ah, hello there, traveler. Come to the night gate for food or lodging? Uh, food and water, actually. Of course. A refill of water to be start with. And then... Let's see that appetite. Hmm? Yeah, let's take a look at the food selection you can offer. Salt? I don't really need salt when doing things over my campfire. But I'll take one of those needs off your hand. And for the road. Perhaps just an ale though. Anything you need, just holler. Yep. Since I've already got some mead on me. To stave off the gold on the road. And speaking of the road, back to it. Now then it shouldn't be too long until I re reach. But on the other, other hand, now that I've had a place to stop at and fill my water, I don't actually need to head to Dawnstar. I could instead go straight for the... What was the place again? Straight for Dim Hollow Creek. Hmm. Why not? Why not indeed? Silver drip flare that I've passed. I'd rather have two bottles of meat than two wenches, friend. Oh, who are you people? Hmm? Why is that? Hail, friend! It's good to see another merry soul the enjoying this fine day. Ah, but you look tired. Come, share a bottle of honey brew mead with me. Ah, but I heard you mention something. I only have one drink when you can have it too. Ismir's beard, you're one after my own heart. I would love another bottle. This good deed should not go unrewarded. Here, take this. Cheers, my friend. May your adventures find you fame and fortune. Thank you. And may your journey not end up in you freezing to death. A charmed necklace. Increase in carrying capacity. Good, but it's no amulet of Stendar. Oh, let's see then. This is probably the right way to go. Yes, it indeed is. More spiders. Whoa! That was a tricky shot. Did I just see another one fly at my face? Well, at least it didn't hit me. I got enough arrows not to care if I leave some behind on, an, on a spider's corpse. Oh, that's why I might have seen them. There we go. That's done with as well. They usually... What evil people usually say is to kill all. Even the children, so they do not grow up to be adults that resent you and come after you. 
but then again, that was a frostbite spider. Should be a road on the left I could take over the mountain. But all of the vigilant is right ahead, I should check up on the destruction of it to confirm it with my own eyes. And perhaps find an amulet for my backpack. For Dunstad. Probably for the better for me not to enter. Yep, better for me to not enter. Might this be the right direction? Yes, it is. But all of the vigilant is on the left. So let's make a quick detour. There. Oh dear. Oh dear, oh dear, oh dear. It's just as bad as I had feared. Death pounds. Vigilance. You will not do anything with those. But... Why? 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 Why would these vampires do this? Why would they come and attack the vigil at their home? Well, if nothing else, they earned the ire of one Lord Vensor. And if I was not determined before, I sure am determined to destroy them now.